Previously on The Walking Dead. I know who you are. Oh, I got another good one for you. been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> And I don't give a shit about what happens to you, but if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. What if I don't want to? There has to be some alternative option here. Don't want to hit the zombie. I don't want to hit him. He's my friend. He's my buddy. Gotta be another way. Can I give him an energy bar? <laughs> Damn it. Who the hell? What'd they get this what? time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. <laughs> what yeah, is this? Except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbits are Can he shave? I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. What? Last night I heard your friend Doug laying in bed just naming types of pie. It was driving me nuts. I think he's starting to lose it. He's not the only one. Won't you cut him some slack? Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Not enough. According to Lily, we've just about hit the last of our food reserves. Some I don't know how much have food to go we have left. Tonight. You mean Lily's lottery again? Kenny's gonna be pissed. She thinks everyone should have an equal uh. chance of missing a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense. Yeah, you want to let Jordan know I'm streaming? You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. He's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you. He's still kicking? Who is this new guy? He's just an old racist asshole. That's his deal. Well, he needs to get over that and start finding a way to pull his weight. Hard problems are not. We should all be out here trying to find food. And <laughs> yeah, I know I Lily saw thinks that he's before weaker, in the text. But the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah. Walking Dead. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Come on. Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. What? Can't hear you. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Please, fucked up. We've gotta help. Us. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad okay. has special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Hurry, please, hurry. Oh. 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 Lee, this <laughs> trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. Shit, walkers. It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Oh boy. Oh. Lee, do something. No, no, no. Try the trap again. <laughs> Anything, please. Try to cut the chain. No. Ah! Ah! Oh. Let's go, let's go. I mean, there was a back button. It has to be now. Oh God! <laughs> right now. Damn it, Lee! Just cut off his fucking. Oh God! Shit! Is he? He passed out. He's free now. Grab him and let's go. He's he's fine. Good as new. <laughs> this is fine. Behind you, Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move. <laughs> See, this is good. If it works. Basically. Yeah, I guess that much that... Oh.
angry. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they <laughs> doing? Come on! Come oh on! My God. What happened? So what the hell are these? Don't have time to explain. Please, Shit! Are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? Can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know. Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? <laughs> we are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group right here, right now. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, uh, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No, I... <laughs> Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person <laughs> can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, Oof. but sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. <laughs> Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? So angry. Whoa. You think this is Whoa. easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food, but nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Can I just give it all to me and Doug? All right, all right, that old guy's not getting anything. All right. Kenny Clem, <laughs> Doug, who is the four? <laughs> oh, of course. All right. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Yeah, no, he's not getting it. Wait, what, what'd she say? Sure. I, I'll Maybe say sure, I don't know. I had it a couple oh. days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Uh, crackers and cheese, duh. Okay. A Sunday would be better next time. <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. If you have any more food, Duck is hungry too. Yeah, why don't we then get some food? You're not getting any, Duck. <laughs> I'm sorry, Duck. You're not, you're not getting any. <laughs> Want something to eat? He can get he can get a piece of jerky. Here, Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. All right, I guess he's the fourth. <laughs> hey, Doc. How about a little food? All right. Yeah, I know. Oh God, that face! That face! 
that face. I don't want to give that face food. That food is gonna like grab the. <laughs> that food is gonna grab. Or that that thing's gonna grab all my food. He Here. gets the apple. Oh heck yes! Is there <laughs> peanut butter? What do you think, Doug? Bro, this kid's at. No, <laughs> probably not. Dang. I, I had a feeling Kenny was gonna be like that. Want something to eat? Here, right. Kenny, take this. Yeah. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, yes, but hand wife. it over. I'm starved. Okay. Thanks. Uh, some of these people have gone No, I know. Kenny's my boy, okay? They're the ones that need it. Alright, where's Doug? <laughs> where's Doug? Where is Doug? <laughs> Where is this? That's not Doug. Oh, okay, okay. Alright. All right, I'll talk to Doug last. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, what is this? Sturdy, but it's not gonna hold up forever, just like the rest of this place. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. <laughs> well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. <laughs> Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. <laughs> I know. Like, I'm not going to say I did the right thing. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's kind of weird. Talk of this kid. Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. <laughs> I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. I can. <laughs> I'm not giving you food. Uh, How you holding up, kid? He does. Uh, well, I, um, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help, you know? Some kind of, I don't know, something. You'll be prepared next time. Next time? Yeah. Hmm. So who are you people? Our group's gonna wanna know. I'm Ben. Ben Paul. <laughs> the man you saved is Mr. Parker, the band director at my school. We all came down Which from Stone Mountain teacher. for the playoffs when... That's Stone Mountain. ...when everything happened. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. How you doing, Doug? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? No. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? A goat? Doug is an idiot. You were pretty brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. Catch you later, Doug. Bye, Lee. How you doing, Clementine? Everything all right? Yeah. Is that man going to be okay? I think he'll be fine. Oh, that's good. I mean, I could say still got that walkie-talkie, but I saw it right there. That thing doesn't work anymore, does it? No, not since it broke at the drugstore. Just gonna 
Hold on to it then? Yeah, if that's okay. I, um, I need it. It's okay, hon. You said they'd find us. I know, I did. And until then... Look, uh, Clementine... I'm not stupid, Lee. I know it's just pretend. But it makes me feel better. Okay, you take good care of it then. I will. That's why okay Clementine... Uh-huh, I'll be okay. Yeah. Ugh, this kid. This kid is... Big, big stupid. What does Kenny have to say? Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. I'm not sure that's the best idea. You gave Glenn your blessing when he left. Just asking you respect my choice as well. Yeah, but he was leaving to find his friends. Your family's right here. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Can Doug come with us? <laughs> <laughs> I want Doug to come with. <laughs> I want, I want Doug. Yo, me, Kenny, Doug on a boat. That'd be hype. The coast does sound like <laughs> right. a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. <laughs> All right. Yes. <laughs> Kenny is my boy. Is that, is that it? Can I like find the hat here? He is. All right. Oh, okay. I can come this way. Is that a hat? Oh, that's a soccer ball. Yeah. At least the kids have something to keep them occupied. Will you hold the damn board steady? Oh, I'm Gosh. trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Hey, you holding up okay, Lee? I was pretty fucked up back there, having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah, I just hope Kadja can save him. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... But nothing! She's making the smart <laughs> choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. <laughs> <laughs> you ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, uh, give us that yes, thing I for do a bit. Mind. Um... Uh, <laughs> feel feel like regardless of this decision, it's going to end up in Larry's hands. <laughs> so I really don't want to give it to anyone. <laughs> here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to yeah. give me the axe? Come on, Larry. Give it a rest, man. Things are different. Being a racist is outdated. Oh, and that's what you <laughs> think this is? <laughs> is that what you told him? <laughs> there, that's right. And what are you gonna do about it? Look, I don't care what it is. 
But you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work! Can I have my axe back now? <laughs> I don't want to give anyone my axe. That's my axe. He's not even... <laughs> there he is. Alright. <laughs> hey, Doug. <clears throat> ah. oh, no. What's up, Lee? What are you working on, Doug? I've worked up a little warning Ooh. system for outside. How does it work? I set up trip lines at four locations, and each one triggers one of these four bells. So... So we'll know where they are and how long we have. Smart. Think Katja can save that guy? Maybe. I mean, I know about computers, but that doesn't mean I can fix a calculator. <laughs> but you probably could fix a calculator. Well, yeah. Good point. Don't suppose I could interest you in some food. Dude, their faces. Actually, why don't you keep my share today? I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me and not Carly, but uh. I owe you a lot more than half a day's rations. Hey, if Doughboy doesn't want his food, hand it this way. It doesn't work like that. I'll decide who gets the food. I'll decide <laughs> smart. You don't really want to piss me off, do you? Yeah, the coast does sound really nice. Alright. Who's getting it? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, some of these people are going someone else. longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Well, let's, let's make Kenny happy. <laughs> Let's give Kenny here. Make Eat Kenny something. happy. Why don't you give it to Doc? I'm a little busy with I your mess gave right it to now. Doc. I need space, Lee. Gosh. Yeesh, I'm about to give it to Larry after that. <laughs> can, I, can I give it to Clem? <laughs> I don't want to give it to the new kid. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I forgot. I completely forgot about you. <laughs> I forgot she was up there. <laughs> we should talk about you and Kenny. What about us? They're arguing. It's getting pretty out of hand. You know people notice that. Look, I'm working my ass off to make sure we have a good setup here, and Kenny just doesn't appreciate that. All we need is food. But there is no food. You know that better than anyone. Well, we'll just have to find some. I'll give her food. Why not? I love how Larry... He's always talking about protecting his daughter. <laughs> but in the end, he's like, Oh, give me that food. But nah. <laughs> My boy... My boy Kenny, <laughs> he's like, give it to Duck. I don't want anything from you. Take it anyway. You need to eat. This doesn't change anything. Eesh. Well, that's it. Not such an easy job, is it? I don't envy you. I don't well, know yeah, how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! 
What happened to my food? There's none <laughs> left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk. Okay. Talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Kaja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? <laughs> Past your screaming. Move, move. Shit, it's stuck. I got him. That is amazing. No, she'd probably go, oh my god, I am on the main Push it off, I don't want to hit you. That's good. Thanks. No I like problem. if I gave Larry we the axe, watch he each wouldn't even backs, do anything. Right? Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad. Calm down. You're gonna get us all <laughs> killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. God help us. It makes sense. In those first few days, it spread so fast. Car accidents, suicides, everything was making more of them. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Doug, it works. Of course it works. I told you. Shit, where'd this string come from? Watch where you're walking, man. Who are those people? I don't know. Are they the people that raided your camp? I don't think so, but they all had their faces covered, so I don't know. There's just two of them. We need to make a stand. No, we have a routine. We don't confront them if we don't have to. You all right? Yeah, just getting untangled. 
I don't know how you're still alive, man. Sorry, Lily. We gotta do this. That's far enough! Oh, uh, shit! Uh, okay, okay. Uh, no problem. We don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. What do you need gas for? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and oh Mark gosh, check this the is, place out? This is <laughs> legit. I'll go too. Improve the numbers in case we run into anything dead. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Uh. Yeah, it'll be a You've fun got a road deal. trip. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Oh, wait, Sounds what? fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Thanks for coming along, Doug. Sure. I'd like to get a look at that electric fence they talked about. It might give me some ideas for something I can rig up at the motor end. Oh, yeah. Can an electric fence really stop walkers? Well, as long as the walkers aren't completely dehydrated and the fence has enough juice, yeah, it seems plausible. The electricity basically cooks you from the inside out, right? I guess so. So, if a walker stays in contact with the fence, it'll eventually cook its brain. Probably takes a while, though. And that can't be a good smell. Unless it smells like jerky. Man, I could go for some jerky. Ugh, I shouldn't have turned down that hey. food you offered me earlier. <laughs> that is one runaway train of thought. <laughs> Sorry. Aw, oh, dang. What's that you got there? Oh, nothing. It's just a laser pointer I picked up during our last trip to the drugstore. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Let's not. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor in. Uh, who's running things over there? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> what you want? We work as a group. Mm. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? I don't trust these guys. Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. Oh, yeah. Getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love dudes. to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can <laughs> remember, but uh, now it's. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man. my camp. Who are they? Fuck you. Fuck you you knew we were hungry. hungry. And are. you guys were keeping it all for yourself. What should we do? Yeah, and you know what? We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out. Hope they move on. Fuck you! <laughs> Crossbow. Take the crossbow. Okay. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. 
<laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. Oh, wow. You guys must know a thing or two about running wire. Had a guy who did, yeah. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. Oh, wow. You've got enough electricity to run the whole place. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, John and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with military experience. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now <laughs> that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We're awful hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Holy moly! Oh my god. Sorry. Can't get stuff oh, like on, that anymore. Spit on the food. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. What? Your cow is sick? What she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip back here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. No problem. Ben can come with me. Take this. All right. See you later. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some oh, help securing the can. perimeter. <laughs> Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously, they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. All right. I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. <laughs> that would be really solid though. You can definitely tell they built this thing themselves. <laughs> hmm. Well, I mean, like, it's wrapped up around there, see? Wrapped around, and then they run the wire in. Hmm. What? <laughs> 
disappointing. Well, I bet they go through a lot of wood keeping those fences repaired. If a couple of tools out in the open is as unsafe as it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor inn. Hmm. Looks like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Yep, can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well on. Okay. Good Well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, <laughs> you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks. What'd you say? Trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. And once again, I was listening to you and not what he was saying. At least the thing on the top left helped. Top. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzling pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertainment these days, I guess. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. Right? Like us? Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will oh, stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the Oops. husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if <laughs> you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Uh oh. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for Dang. any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Whatever. Stay attentive. Never know. Waited. <laughs> so how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? <laughs> it's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. Why the hell did you have to tell him I thought he was a racist? As if tensions weren't high enough. Sorry, man. It just... it popped out. I mean, you did admit it right to his face. I try to be civil, at least. He's too busy being um, cranky to notice. That... <laughs> There's one. Ugh. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Who do you think he was? At least it's not one of us. Looks like he's stuck. Maybe the St. John boys are using this guy for target practice? Ah, uh, poor guy. I don't know what got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was Probably already dead. Probably one of the bandits. He had, a, he had a crossbow. Disgusting. Yummy. Andy said when this what? fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Come on, I'm sure there's still a few more. 
Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers anymore? Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food, but the St. John's need gas, too. Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas, easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. There's another one. I see it. I don't see it. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Man, the fence burnt right into its hands. I think they fused together. You never get used to the smell, do you? <laughs> nope. That's cool. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Would have been nice to get some of those rations. I get hungry too, you know. We'll go ask for more to eat after this is done. Alright, I can suck it up. <sighs> Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> Little help here, Lee? No. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. What the? Get to the gate! Get down! You asshole! Jesus! We had an agreement! Now you're fucked! Who the fuck is that? No idea! Fuck! Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out! Man, rat! We had a deal! are stuck in the dirt. We can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! Now you're shit. But he is not using the tractor as cover at all. What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move. If I'm moving too close, can I get one over? <laughs> Another one? How many of those things did we push down? I said if I like get too close, like to the big wheel, can I get one over? Oh, stop. Over there. Oh. 
You okay? Yeah, barely. Come on. The gate's right there. You ain't seen your fucking ass. Where? Get out of here! You lucky sons of bitches! Go ahead and run! We ain't going nowhere! Let's leave the gate open so that walker is still Lee! What's wrong? Uh, there was a goddamn ambush out there! Holy shit, are, are you okay? And it's here? On our property? Oh my lord! What happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all! Mark! Oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just... Pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? We ran into Psst. some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Killed a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. You knew about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. Damn it! Doug said this place was safe. Maybe it isn't as safe here as we thought. Look, we're sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's oh, real yeah, charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Doug? Since Doug ate half the biscuits on the way to get us, I had them. No, stay I hate back. this guy even more. I still now. don't think we no, should be trying to stay fake. here. And someone's got to watch the motor in until we get back. Hey, uh, I remember seeing <laughs> kids like, in your group, so to, like, I went ahead and fixed that ooh. swing while you were out. I hope your kids like swings. A swing? I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Right next to an electric fence. Yeah, that's 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 the first thing I want to do. How do how do I get there? <laughs> oh, here, here, right. No, this isn't. Wasn't this one like this way? No. All right. Wow, it's hay bales. Enough of these oh, there it is. Adequate cover from arrows, if that becomes a problem. Yeah. Ah. Uh. If there's not enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Oh, I said use the barn door, not talk about the barn door. Gosh. Looks time. like a feeding station for the cow. Oh snap, this is like the final boss battle right here. <laughs> oh. <laughs> like I just walk up and I see this. 
Oh, I can't even talk to him. <laughs> Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything, but gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? You're a good leader, though. Yeah, sure. Kenny's too emotional, but his intentions are in the right place. Still, it would be best for all of us if you two could try to work together once in a while. Eh, whatever. No. Never. I've said enough. Pointy. Yes. Yes. Oh, I can't, like, get hit by Doc. Hey, Clem, do you like the swing? Yeah, it's fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. Happy to push you on the swing. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Oh, man, that was epic. Oh, he rubbed his butt. That was an epic. <laughs> Dude, what is that face he's making? How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Dude, his face was Are you just okay? like. <laughs> yeah, I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? You're lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Well, we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. What do you think of the dairy? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? I'm not sure, Clint. I hope so. I hope so, too. I'm not going right. to save our safe That's here. enough for now. Okay, thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah! Look okay, at his face. Duck, don't pop a gasket. Oh wait, can I talk to him? Yeah, I can. The, what? Oh. Hey. Hey, Lee. Found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. Oh. This is interesting. Did Duck and Katja get here okay? No, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja can have an easier life here. That's funny, considering you didn't seem too worried about Duck back at Herschel's farm. That's in the past, Whoa. Kenny. A lot's happened since then. Yeah, right. Whoa. How you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? He's really selfie. I guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch them go hungry. You're with me on this, right? 
Yeah, of course. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you got a pretty clear head about these things. <laughs> oh, yeah? I'm gonna go have a look around. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Marcel, watch my stream. <laughs> Sounds pretty dumb. Fellas, how you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work in a big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Are you going now? Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Yeah. Pretty fancy. I know it's around here. It's gotta be close. Hmm? Season one, episode two. Oh it's this door. Ah. Uh I got the game pass Xbox Game Pass for a little bit. And it's free on that. Uh. Here. Oh shit, you found it? Too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Yuck. I don't need that. Just water. Empty. Got some gasoline. Nothing.
gonna take a sip. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <laughs> I'll pass. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. It looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid-sized. What'd you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these. Recently. her to look at. Can I go near him? Yeah, that's what I do. What haven't I looked at? I looked at that. I looked at all this. Oh, you can go in the den? Oh, man. your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. You people broke it first. Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a what? hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? 
I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball and into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. Wait, what? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Put down the crossbow. No, sir, I need it. I need it to kill you fuckers. <laughs> Go on, tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for- oh. How may I assist you? God damn it! Well, thanks. I guess. Well, you're welcome. I guess. Oh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get first. the message. A crossbow. Thank you. Come on. No, I need the hat. I need the hat. I, I need the hat. Oh, I have it? Okay, cool. That hat is what I came here for. <laughs> Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Handled it, Mama. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, Princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry and people get a little stir-crazy when their tummy's empty. Didn't they say and dinner, Lee, like, who's don't worry right your now? head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is what? a lifesaver. Seen it. <laughs> <laughs> Said, yep, Tim look. And my camera roll too. <laughs> ah, the final boss of the game. Larry. Larry's the real villain. Can I sit on the swing? All fixed. That should make everyone happy. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. 
Okay, I don't like this guy. You really like that girl. What's not to like? Okay. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, that cat, those cat noises are coming out of my sister's phone, Marcel. <laughs> Guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get okay. any visitors? Not anymore. I want to talk to this guy anymore. <laughs> Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead oh. time. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too, or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Okay, what the... What the oh, okay, I don't like that guy. <laughs> I don't like that guy at all. Andy is... Oh, where's... What was his name, Andy? He's... That tool is still out. If a couple of tools out in the open okay, is as okay, unsafe this as again? it gets, we'll be fine here. Would have been nice to have one of these back at the motor end. Okay, I already said that. What is this? Is this new? It's a small toolbox. Multi-tool. That should be handy. Wouldn't that technically be stealing? <laughs> I think that would be considered stealing. <laughs> then, uh, uh, I feel like Danny would see that. You know? Oh. Danny's scary. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Watch the house just burns down. Like, oh, so uh, it was cooking too long. Oh, true. Yeah. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. Yeah, we're not going to. Nothing ends like this. <laughs> Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy and had a crossbow. So Danny killed her. Holy shit. Was she one of those bandits? I don't know. I think she was trying to tell me something. But then he just went off. I don't like this, Lee. I still say we should go back to the motor inn where we at least know what to expect. I'm really curious, like, about your dad, like, he's sitting right there. <laughs> Does that mean he's gonna raise his- Does that f No, yeah, he was, that's why I didn't say- <laughs> Like, does that mean if I bring that up, option up, is he gonna start yelling so loud that they hear that he's crazy? Cause he's been acting all nice. <laughs> What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. I think we all know how she feels about leaving the motor in, so I'm not even gonna ask. I'm just curious what this brings up. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? All right, there we go. Okay. It's been three months. 
Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much. <laughs> and lost... pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. Do you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry what? about it. What? I literally just told her what happened. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Time to look in the barn. <laughs> Oh, I mean, I tried to open the barn before, but it was all like, oh boy, you, uh, this is a barn. And then it just stopped, and I was like, oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, Danny's got a clear sight of that barn. In the barn? What? When was she in the barn? He was? Really? I don't remember that. Oh. It is not that dark outside. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Cow bites Clementine. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I probably did. I don't know. <laughs> I bet Doc licked it. <laughs> Doc definitely licked it. Uh, I, I, I would choose to believe that Doc licked it. <laughs> no, no, I don't believe that. <laughs> oh, Andy's right here, so... So, like, he'll probably get annoyed if I start looking in these. I, mean, I could clearly see over it. <laughs> hey there, Andy. Yeah. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Thanks. Yep. How do you like that cow, Clint? <gasps> I have the hat. She's pretty. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I don't know. I have.
haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Oh, I want to pet the cow. Look at cow. She looks skinny. <laughs> what? What the heck is Duck doing today? Have I missed anything? No, not really. Mm, it smells funny in here. Like duty. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Kids. I know. <laughs> <laughs> what if she said manure? How do you like that cow, Clem? <laughs> She's pretty. Oh, I was... Uh, oh, I thought that was Katja. Hey there, Andy. Yeah? We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Did uh, she? Yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Okay. Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Thanks. <laughs> yep. Duck's face. Like, these are probably the things that, like, what's her face? I already forgot her name was hinting towards uh, they don't like nosy people like <laughs> so I'm just not gonna look in there <laughs> you know although Danny's probably got something weird hidden away there you know <laughs> <laughs> so how does a woman like oh, yourself no. run this whole place oh no oh, I manage just fine plus I have my boys to help no <laughs> no Larry <laughs> Larry, no. <laughs> Larry, no. Come, come on, Larry. Really, Larry? <laughs> come on. Are you, you gotta be kidding me, Larry. <laughs> He's still petting his gun. Next, next game I play, I wanna, I wanna be Larry. <laughs> We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. There we go. I saved the day. You've been getting along with Larry. <laughs> he's just a big old sweetheart, no, no, ain't he? No, he's not. Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. <laughs> Why are you out here instead of cooking? That's what I'm wondering. How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys are, get are they so cooking much Mark? scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. My question is, I'd are they cooking like Mark out. right now? You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. No, they're I've definitely cooking my Mark wounds. right now. I know what I'm talking about. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Why did you make a deal with those people? We got a thread of humanity left, Lee. No, you we don't. can You're do definitely more good without them Mark. in our hair by placating them. So that's what we do. Uh, Mark is a dude that got shot with an arrow earlier, and he is supposedly being stitched up inside right now, but, uh, I think that they're cannibals and they're cooking him. Uh. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful no. out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you no can. No one's allowed to be nice You'll in the walk. probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. You see, you know what? Maybe I should be friends with Larry now. Maybe he's. Can I not do anything else? Like, what is this? Mark is okay in there. Mark is dead, okay? I've accepted that fact. 
I have to find Kenny. Where the heck is Kenny? Was Kenny like in the door in the back of the barn? What? He's being no. He is being nosy. That's what. Whoa. What's Larry Starter's name again? I forgot. Lily, yeah, li Lily. She, she's, <laughs> she's. <li> <laughs> yeah, I mean, Larry is definitely. This Wait, is a gazebo. Doesn't offer much in the way of protection. Hey, I'm okay, gonna go check know. things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Do I have to be nosy to progress the story? <laughs> I want to see what happens if I'm not. What? You don't think I can not be nosy? So then should I grab the multi-tool? <laughs> should I grab the multi-tool? I mean like... Danny has a clear view of the multi tool and he is betting his gun right now. I know, I'm just I'm just saying it out loud. Oh well, how surprised he is when it It's not that dark outside. Like I have to it's scary. I'm gonna go to this one. Wow, boxes. Epic. About this one. Epic. <sighs> oh, I probably used the multi tool. Like, no, I don't. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight <laughs> the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is, we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You what? Back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Doug could get in here. Where the heck is Doug? <laughs> oh, right, 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 right. Forgot about that. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Yeah, I probably used the multi tool well, for that. You're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. <laughs> Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. <laughs> Florida Sorry. man. Hmm. He's well, a Florida see man. See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. <laughs> Can I help you boys find something? Kenny thought he heard a noise. He's a little jumpy, huh? Well, we're all sure glad his wife is here. She's a lifesaver. You, you got no idea. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc.
What? What? Go what something for you? What? No, I'm not. Do it yourself. I'm playing a game too, Des. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Did Danny see Danny? See you home. Safe. Yeah. At least I have my axe. You guys having fun? Uh huh. How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. All of these options are very obvious. <laughs> One is straight up asking. Like. <laughs> Danny mentioned stuff. he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Yeah, he's suspicious. What if I do nothing while he's waiting? Ooh. Eerie. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Dang. I hope he's not gonna question that, like. Hmm. Here. up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. I want to play in the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. Okay. <laughs> Doc. <laughs> it's a feeding trough. <laughs> Say. I tried distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there no, you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What about those generators? <laughs> Bro, I'm just gonna mess the whole place up and we're gonna be attacked. Like, I don't wanna be doing this. Like, he's not doing this an option. <laughs> I don't wanna do this. <laughs> Literally just turn it off. Access. I guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. Like, <laughs> like that's not gonna be good enough. That's gonna be fishy. <laughs> that's even more fishy. Oh yeah. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. <laughs> Dude, 
<laughs> that wasn't gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I didn't think it wouldn't work that fast. <laughs> Dude, if I do it here. There you go. <laughs> what happens if I walk away now? I'm gonna do it one more time. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I love how Larry's just watching this whole thing happen, like, <laughs> not saying anything. Larry's probably gonna throw me under the bus here. <laughs> there, that should do it. I'm not going to close it. <laughs> and he's stupid. Fucking Danny, where do you find this oh, piece okay. of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, all. Ah, oh, son of a Fuck! God, this take forever. Oh, hey, the mailbox. I can look at it. No mail coming in or out these days. At least they don't have to worry about bill collectors anymore. Ha <laughs> ha. I do. <laughs> oh no, I don't want to do that. Oh, I can't talk to him. I mean, like, that'd be funny, though. What time is it? Oh gosh, it's like. Later half. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Why can't Kenny do this? Like, come on. Oh, yeah, there's a back button. Uh, I'm in now. I'm in now. I'm in now. What if I leave now? Three screws out, and I leave. <laughs> Boy, didn't you hear? 
hear the bell? Dinner time. Oh god, it is Mark. What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still gotta do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Yeah. <laughs> you I'm surprised he's not super mad. Like, excuse me, screaming. Blocked the back door after a walk got upstairs. Don't worry, that was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody, sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, yeah. This is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mark is. Dinner. Right if I wash my hands first. Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Mark is dinner. Where? That's a tripwire. That is a tripwire. <laughs> Walkers aren't getting through that thing. I'm gonna... Beauty. Like, I wanna wash my hands, gosh. There's soap in here? Is this soap? Where's the soap? Is this soap? Some kind of lotion. No, nope, that's lotion. Gauze pads. No, no, that's not even. Like... Can I wash my hands? I could use a shave. Wash my hands. Come back and say, "Hey, I wash my hands." Help! Okay, I'll help you. I could just plug it in without knowing what's gonna happen. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Musty as hell. What do they need so much morphine for? What is that connected to? <laughs> Where the hell is Mark? Thought Brenda said he was up here resting. Is that blood? Uh, farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here.
I'm gonna plug it in. Why not? <laughs> Why? Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV2 <sighs> What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Huh, what is that cord Nothing. going? This music. <laughs> what? Creepy music. Sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee. What's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. It didn't have to be this way. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. The hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. You're all sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways. One way or another. Like y'all. Clementine, run! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the what? The fucking black. Put your fuck? guns down. We're walking out don't of come here. here, my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die, Mommy. What did I eat? Somebody do something. You son of a bitch! Bare hand. We gotta find another way out of here. 
of us did, God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They... they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn thumb sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walker! Dad, please! Please settle down! Oh, I'll they got caught you in a duck, Lee! Those fuckers have my swallow. family! I know! We're gonna get out of here and find them! Come on! Try us out! Could there be a oh, hole Lord. behind Dad. these pallets? No such luck. There's more of us on the way! Let us out now! Do you want to live? That is not going to help! I don't want to know what kind. They're not going to open the door! You, you think a fucking apocalypse Shelves are pretty sturdy. Right we could climb up. Uh, but there's no way out through the ceiling. <laughs> Dad, this isn't helping! Red bastards. Salt legs. Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Ah, door's too solid. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, uh, Come on, Easy! Right, 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 right. Dad? No, Larry, we need your muscle. No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? Come on, he's Larry. He's not we dead. Need your Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead. He's not dead. What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, oh, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you. We can bring him back. Lee! Morning later, but right now we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He is not oh dead! Oh god. We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Oh god. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. <laughs> like this. God damn it, Lee. I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Uh, Wake uh, up. I need Larry's I muscle. Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Uh. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn! You're putting all of us at risk, what? you son of a bitch! Two. You're fucking worthless, Three. Lee. No. No! <laughs> Kenny, I'm sorry. What the fuck? I'm so sorry. I just... It had to be done. You don't know that! Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. I'm sorry. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! <laughs> yeah, I know. Are you okay? Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. <laughs> I know. Okay, I still I got know. Doug. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? Come on, can I look? Go away. Uh... Getting out of here. 
We're gonna get out, right? I'm just staying at stupid out? Xbox Live achievements and stuff. Right. Keep blocking my dialogue. <laughs> he was still lively. He was still alive. You have to think about saving your own life now. It's what he would have wanted. <laughs> He's gonna be. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. What now? What? You don't want to hang me up on a meat hook and leave me to rot? What I want isn't important. What I know is their safety in numbers. You got any ideas? The air conditioner. Where is the air conditioner? Here it is. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Clementine? <laughs> oh no. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off. If I had something to remove the screws, the multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, uh, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh -uh. It's not coming off that way. <laughs> <laughs> it's not coming off that way. Larry definitely had a coin. <laughs> He's got a coin. I'm sorry, Lily. Please, I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But do you have but if a we're gonna point? get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver or a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? That's what he grabbed for. <laughs> Just kidding. Oh. Man, state quarters. That's cool. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Is my boy no longer? <laughs> well, here's our way out, Lee. <laughs> Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for yes, us to fit. It's all Larry's fault. Do it. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? 
See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. <laughs> I needed his muscle. <laughs> No, I needed his muscle. Mine was solely practical reasons. Are you uh, <laughs> Did anyone see you? No, but there's a man outside. Where the hell are you going? <laughs> what do you care? Kenny! I needed his muscle. Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. The man. Hey, we're good. Larry's okay? muscle. <laughs> yeah. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. No. <laughs> what? No. I refuse to accept that. Doug is not a side character. human slaughterhouse. Oh yeah, communism. Proletariat will rise again. No, no, I'm going sickle. Get out of here. Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just going in the place like you said. Mm -hmm. Sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Take one to keep and kill the rest. And I pick which one to come from behind. Not the kid. Ain't enough meat on the tray. <laughs> oh, I know, Mabel. This hey, is my keep your eye out too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. Hey, tell me something. Sick fucker thinks this is a game. I kind of guessed that. We'll take him out together. Oh gosh, my cursor was all the way, uh... <laughs> I'm t I told you I'm gonna die a lot in this. Communism. Oh, yes! Yes! Yeah. No! You 
see? You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Get part of yourself so others can live. I should fucking kill you right now. That's why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Yeah. No! Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> gotcha! Just go. I'll keep Clementine safe. <laughs> you going to kill me? Watch me. Okay, what, the head? I'm sorry? <laughs> Just because he says you can't kill me. Kitty! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dog. The hell? Where's that coming from? We heard screams from the barn. What's going on? These people are fucking crazy. I knew it. I told you we couldn't trust them. Where is everybody? What can we do to help? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Jesus, that's sick. They've still got Duck and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. No. If we storm the house, we'll cause a panic. You two try to find a way around to the back. I'll head to the front. You got it. Come on, this way. Wait, are you sure? Yes. No. Yes. Danny in the barn. He got what he deserved. Oh, God. <laughs> Come here. Let me go. Please get back. Don't come in here. You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? I don't go, Brenda. I love how it didn't even give me an option to wash my hands. Please. Please don't you take another step. Brenda. Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there, I mean it. Oh. oh. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> Think 
about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. Ah, uh, killer Lee! Just let me go. It was a little gas to keep ourselves safe. Yes, yeah, stop.
Dang. Really could have used, uh, really could have used Larry's muscle there, though. That would have been helpful. Hey, Lee. I'm sorry for leaving the motor in unattended. I never thought a laser pointer would be the thing that saved our lives. I'm glad you showed up when you did. Well, we gotta stick together. Were they really chopping up people? For food? Yeah. And Clementine almost ate some. Man, that is sick. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She didn't see or... I stopped her. This fucking world now. It's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Ugh. <clears throat> Were you guys able to he salvage anything good from the dairy? Not really. St. John's took everything I had before the place got completely overrun with walkers. Oh, I was able to grab a couple of your things back while uh, Brenda wasn't looking. It doesn't work. You have any use for it, Doug? It's just a basic camcorder. The save lot's cheapy. Let me check it out, see if I can get it working. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You know, hero, you destroyed Ooh. two lives in that meat locker. Ooh. Ooh. Kenny, you're not a bad man, but fuck. What the hell are we gonna do now? Oh, I can walk. No, I can't. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Sounded like it. Lee, did you have to kill those men? I'm sorry you had to see that, but I only did it to protect us. Because they tried to hurt us? Yes. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? And Sounds like a car. Oh god, not more strangers. Yeah. He's like, he's you. So you're watching me play. Hello? I was just like... How long can I keep this foot levitated? Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? 
Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? Ooh. Why can't this one be timed? I'll sit here all day. Gonna making decisions. You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. Clementine and I don't want any part of this. We're starving. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay, what have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? Any electronics? Radios? Batteries? Man, even dog stick. Here. <laughs> got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. <laughs> She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Here, Clem. Want some... Uh, batteries? Hey, <laughs> Lee. You know that camcorder? I got it working. You might want to see this. <laughs> Sweetheart, we won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you like, help me find it? That her mom? When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. Like, I promise. If you're thinking it, you're I'll safe, you know. sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. Like what? The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you've got to be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. People who took. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. On. <laughs> this place is done. It's time to move on. Screw it. Not like you ever listen to a damned word I say. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. Lily's not doing so good, huh? You murdered her dad. I did what I had to and you know it. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. You're so full of bullshit! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort all this out, all right? We can sort this out! I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Hey. 
Zvon.